Welcome to Game Night tonight for another unboxing of this Smash Up expansion, What Were We Thinking? So let's dive right in here. If you've not played Smash Up, it's a lot of fun. It's a game where you smash up two different factions to create a deck of cards in which you use to cast minions and actions to place them on different bases and take control of them to get the basis control and victory points that come with that. The more victory points you have, the quicker you're able to win out the game and beat your other opponents. So first and foremost, we have in this our instruction manual of how to play the game, how it all goes down, the different specifications on the cards, how all that happens, and if you have any questions, of course, there's always going to be clarification on what exactly every single card does, right? So that helps us know everything that we need to know to be able to play this game to the fullest, right? So there's the instructions for that. With this expansion come these new tokens. Not entirely sure what the tokens do, but uh, maybe it's just to count up your victory points overall to, to uh, get your ultimate victory as time goes on. But on top here we have, if you have a lot of these expansions, there are a ton of Smash Up expansions out there. There is a bigger, geekier box in which you can organize your factions. And these are hard plastic cards so that you can divide, uh, divide them up evenly so that you can have your factions completely divided, easier to find and pull out and then put back. So we've got, in this particular expansion, we're gonna have the Grannies, we're gonna have the Explorers, we're gonna have the rock stars. And we're going to have the teddy bears. Make it a little bit more fun like that. Interesting. Um, so we're going to hop right into these. I will note, uh, have you note that at the bottom right of every single card, and I will show you once I'm able to get this open, the bottom right of every single card, there's always a little artwork that shows you what faction they belong to. So if you look here, it's the Explorer faction. This little picture at the bottom right of every single card will help you divide up those cards later so that you can smash them up after you've divided them back up and then smash them up again for another game entirely. So first and foremost on the Explorers, we've got the Minions Glory Hound. And I'm going to be going through these kind of quick so you can stop, freeze the frame so you can see the different abilities that these cards have. But I'm just going to be reading the, the ultimate name of that card and then whether it's a minion or action and then you can do the rest. So we have the Crypt Looter. Got a few of those. You've got the Guide. A couple of those. And of course, the Indiana Jones looking guy, Idaho Smith. And moving right on into our actions here, we've got the Lost City. A couple of those. The Forgotten Horrors. The Fortune and Glory. Got a couple of those. It belongs in a museum. And these are like straight out of a movie or something, as if like Indiana Jones just hopped onto this. All right, I said no camels. This is definitely Indiana Jones if I've ever seen one. All right, X never marks the spot. And Dr. Livingstone, I presume. And that wraps it up. Oh, no, it doesn't. I was like hidden behind this one. Dang. And then for the last action, you call this archaeology? Of course, Indiana Jones running for his life which usually happens. All right, so that is that faction of the Explorers. Moving on to the next faction. This, this game of Smash Up is so much fun. I love adding the different dimensions because each faction has their own power, but when you mash them up with another faction, sometimes it's harder, sometimes it's easier, sometimes you just get a little OP, other times it's a little bit more challenging to come up with what you need to to take control of those bases. But in this one, we have the rock stars. We've got the groupie, of course. There's a lot of groupies. That's how it always goes. So you got the groupies. You got Rick Roll. Never wanna give you up. Never wanna hurt you down. All right, we got the classic rocker. Digging the, the artwork here, as per usual. And of course, the monarch. Huh. Thank you very much. Moving on to our actions, we've got the power ballad. It's always one tearjerker. He's even crying. Dang. Turn up to 11. That's why everybody's deaf now. You know, rockers just rock hard. Reunion tour. 
So it doesn't matter how old you get, you can always get up on stage with your walker and you know perform the best of your ability. All right, the total sellout. There's a couple of those because it's gonna happen a couple times. Rock of Love. The guest star. And Hot Venue Cavern. Finally, you got the tour bus. Of course you have to have the tour bus in there. All those rockers. So there you have it for that faction of the rockers. We're gonna move on to the grandmas here. Uh, grandmas look interesting. Reason why we picked up this particular expansion, we haven't gotten all the expansions just yet, but this particular expansion just looks super colorful. I mean, you look at the artwork on the cover there, you got the rockers, you got Elvis, Indiana Jones girl, you got the teddy bear and a grandma. Like, who, who mashes up factions like that? That's, it's crazy, but it's fun. All right, so of course we got little old grandma. Just the typical grandma, knitting. We've got Nana. She's very good at reading. Reading books to the children among the fire. All right, and then we got Granny. You always got to have Granny with the shotgun. I love her little hat, too, and the, the hay coming out of her mouth. It's perfect. All right, and then the matriarch. You don't mess with her, that's for sure. Moving on to the actions for this faction is always room at Granny's. She invites anyone and everyone. And you got chicken soup, heals the soul. Maybe not this guy's face. Looks like a zombie, but she's gonna try anyway. All right, don't mess with my babies. So grandma will ward off any werewolves. It's pretty awesome. And I love that the, the design here is a doily for the grandmas. It's perfect, perfect. So the attic treasures, you always have attic treasures. A couple of those. Got knitting circle. <laughs> They're wrapping up this gorilla, this mad gorilla here. Got Granny's Purse, always has everything. It's, a, it's its own pharmacy, its own candy shop. You got everything in there, right? It's always Granny's Purse. It's the, the place to go wherever you, whenever you need something. Hush, my stories are on. So grandma's very intent on watching that television show. And the family reunion. So this is just like all the different factions, different various factions that they have throughout the entire game of Smash Up. So there you have it for the Grannies. They look pretty exciting, pretty fun, and you know, Always reliable, as grandmas are. All right, moving on to our final faction of the teddy bears. Excited about this faction, because, you know, teddy bears being all snuggly, what can they do? We have the snuggly bear. Of course, we've got a bunch of snuggly bears, because what bear is not snuggly? And the lovey bear. Perfect. And you got the fun bear. Looks like one of the care bears, but it looks like a book. I don't know, something. And then, Sir Squeezes. Nice. Their actions include a tea party. Gotta have a tea party with a bunch of teddy bears. The cuddle. Because even as a vampire, you can't resist a cuddle from a teddy bear. Are you kidding? Got a couple of those. You got a care package. A couple of those. Group hug. That reminds me of the movie Trolls. Oh, group hug time. You got bear picnic. It's always good to have a picnic with your teddy bears. Too cute. Too cute. Mm. Love overload. There can never be love overload. Not with teddy bears. Square deal. Man, these teddy bears are really mean business. All right, and also in that pack, includes all of our different bases that come with this particular expansion. So first we have the City of Gold, the Ancient Temple. So there's always like two to three ba bases that come with each faction. So for the grannies, we have the Retirement Community, of course. <laughs> That's awesome. And Grandma's House. And some of these require a lot, like whew, 27 to get this Palooza. This Palooza for the rock stars. And Lick, Lake Minnetonka. And then we have Under the Bed. And finally, Out in the Woods. 
there you have it. You have all these new bases, uh, the four different new factions which come with this game. Uh, makes it a lot more fun. The more you mash up, like with this, if you could play a two-player game if you really wanted to, but that'd be as much as you could get because you need to mash this up with the base game, which has more factions to be able to play with two to four players. But ultimately, a lot of fun there. We got grannies. We've got explorers with the Indiana Jones faction here. We've got the rock stars, of course, and finally the teddy bears. So you have all those different cards, the different minions and actions. You got your divider cards here, which will help in organizing as you keep adding to your collection of smash up expansions. And you've got your tokens here that it comes with, which I'm sure are to keep track of your victory points. This did not come with the base game, but it comes with the expansions, which is really nice to keep track of those victory points. And last but not least, you have your instructions here to help you know exactly what you're doing with the game and what each of the faction cards do, etc. So there you have it for this unboxing of Smash Up's expansion, What Were We Thinking? I'm really excited to add this one in. It's a little bit more colorful. It's got grannies, you got explorers, teddy bears, Elvis, and all the other rock stars. It's gonna be a lot of fun to add this in with all the other Smash Up factions that I have, Smash Up expansions, etc. So it's gonna be a lot, a lot of fun. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you choose this expansion, I don't, I don't think you'll be the least bit upset or disappointed. So there you have it for our unboxing of Smash Up Expansion, what were we thinking? Join us again next time on Game Night Tonight for other game unboxings, other game playthroughs, different things like that, what have you. Um, and we will see you again on those videos next time.